Hello friends, welcome to another edition of Let's Talk Nifty. Uh, joining after a long break, uh, multiple reasons, we'll explain in some other video. So let's uh, start with uh, where we are now and uh, let's try to understand what would be the index's next move. Starting with the weekly chart, beautiful breakout. Uh, finally mission 19,000 was achieved and what a beautiful move it gave. Uh, so the last three candles on Nifty daily have been really uh, just uh, bulls complete domination so unless it, it's going to break this low here 18648 18700 uh forget about shorting it it's not going to happen um if it opens with a, in a huge gap of maybe you know you can try something intraday but the trend is firmly up so what could be the end of this or what would be the place from which we could expect a correction so i'm expecting around 19310 uh, as the target for this particular up move um 90 anywhere between 900 or just you know 50 point buffer or even 19.450 if it crosses that uh i don't think it's going to cross 19.500 so before a correction okay so why do i say that because if you see daily chart you can see that for the last four days ft has been in an up move so maybe another day our up move or even today could be a, a sideways day uh, let's see how it goes so uh nifty is pretty simple yeah if it is if it doesn't open up with a crazy gap uh, we are looking to buy and uh, uh, you know, if it opens somewhere around this area 19,200 to 19,150 that's the area where uh, we would expect the market to settle and uh, give us a nice up move. Uh, no shorting uh, I've been telling this from quite some time now so when the time is right we'll move to the shutter scam right now we are firmly in the bull scam now if I look at bank nifty on the weekly finally it has broken out of that uh, I got killer uh, zone of 4,400 and, and plus sort of plus 500 points. So Bank Nifty is uh, also made a great weekly candle, right? If you look at the daily chart, Bank Nifty, although it has gone up, it's really not done that much distance. So there's a lot more legs in Bank Nifty. Could easily go to 45,200, some expectation. Um, so let's see how it goes. Again, here there is no shorting till this uh, swing low is broken. Uh, every dip is a buying opportunity, so we need to look at uh, the right place to enter with the right candlestick signal. So, again, uh, Bank Nifty has been doing this for the last two days, gaps up, then it makes intraday high and then hangs around there for the rest of the day. So, which means that, you know, uh, Bank Nifty could, go, could give a big move, uh, 700, 800 points a day, uh, but if it gaps up huge, um, then we may have to stay away. So, if it opens anywhere between uh, 44,800 to uh, 44,700. This is where, you know, or 700, or even you can say that this one, 650. 44,800 to 44,650 is our ideal opening area where we can uh, expect market to go sideways and then again go up. So these two are the only probabilities that I see for uh, trading. And again, uh, I'm, I'm not going to be a seller for Bank Nifty unless there is uh, some global incident and then we gap down very badly. So, more power to bulls and let's stay with the trend look for candlesticks at the right places to go along and i wish you all a very good trading week and i hope you liked this update and thank you very much for joining in today bye bye